The first thing you need to do when you unbox your micro VRC is to set the IP address. We do this through the standard Windows interface. So if we go down to Networks and select Network Settings, and then within Network Settings, select Ethernet and Change Adapter Options. You'll notice that there are two Ethernet ports on your micro VRC, and only one of those will be plugged into your network. So here we have Ethernet showing cable unplugged, and Ethernet 2, an identified network. This is the one that you have to set your IP address for. Right click over Ethernet 2, select Properties, and then within this dialog box, select Internet Protocol version 4, and again Properties. You will note that it's currently set to obtain an IP address automatically. We need to set a static IP address, which we do by clicking on Use the following IP address and then we set the network address that we wish to use. You would normally use a private network IP address. 192.168 is a common range to use. What you need to do is you need to make sure that you set your micro VRC to a unique IP address. What we would suggest is something like 10 and then set your Vantage heads in the range of 100 plus. Once you've set the IP address, you need to finally set the subnet mask. This can be filled in automatically by hitting the tab key, then click on OK, close your windows, and your IP address has now been set up on your micro VRC.